You can sort of tell when they're real because they follow you for a long time. Hey, that's enough. Just want to have a quick look around this. I needed to find the key. 101. Oh no, they're doing that symbol stuff on it again. One oh four. Oh, come on, really? Not openable? Ah. Uh. Oh, we can't open that. What a shame. That's just such a darn shame. The room at the end of the corridor was closed off. It felt significant. Something terrible would happen there. Like a murder? What was that sound? People need to clean their garbage. Bathtub. Death by electrocution. Lots of different ways this can go. We got these big boxes now. They got even more stuff. God, there's always periodically so many weird noises. The paintings are weird. Everything here is weird. We can't go upstairs. Probably for the best. Alright. We got the entrance hall in the final scene. Pre-show ritual. Preparations were underway for the theater play. The plot changed the details of the world. It sounds sick, by the way. The audience also participating in the play by walking around the theater and stuff, or at the hotel. Oh, they look so real sometimes. Okay, the place is set up. We've got some chairs, we've got the posters already. Forbidden play brought to life. Only played once. Does that mean the final scene will be open? Will something be open? Not yet? It means there's a whole bunch of posters everywhere. That's the biggest difference I see so far. I didn't have the key. Yeah, I know, I know, I know. I'm just checking the place out. It actually doesn't seem that different. Final scene. I mean, I could try putting the pre-show ritual here. In preparation of the horror show. Still not open. The prop room had been changed from room 104 to room 225. For a later use in the ballroom play. The troop were busy building their own wicker man, where they themselves would be sacrificed. Is that the main thing that changed here? One oh four. So if we go into it right now, one oh four is not gonna be the prop room, because they changed it already. Disappear. One oh four. Still looks like the prop room to me.
<clears throat> you don't gotta burst onto the scene like that. Now this isn't part of the rooms that- Oh. Wait, what? This links to... What the hell? Wait, this is a different place. Where are we now? Oh, we're in 225 now! The... That means, did I- the pre-show ritual, did I need it for the beginning entrance hallway then? Because I didn't find what needed to be found there. I used the pre-show ritual on the final scene immediately. I think I need a little bit of space. Let's put away the batteries. Put away the one? I need to change the amount on each sack. That would be good. But I can't. Well, I'll keep looking around until I hit a roadblock. So that was 225. Call it awake. Yeah, what? Hurry up, hurry up! Get out of my story, he says. Reserved for rehearsals, 202. It was locked from the other side. Whoa! Oh! How do I stop that? Oh, no. All right, I know you're real. Oh, jeez. That one's fake. This one's real. This story is a monster. You don't have a one in my story. Oh! You escape. I don't have time to reload. Okay, that was this side. Did you all want to come out and let me kill you before I move on and look around? Seems like there was some stuff here. Special room? Oh... Man, the flares and the stuff... I think after you use a flashbang, it does some automatic switching to a weapon. And I don't expect it to switch automatically, which sometimes messes with my flow a little bit. Oh, I have a full inventory. Again. Let's, let's use some flares then if we can. What are you telling me to look at here? Should I break that? Well, that helped. <laughs> You're telling me to get inside here. Hmm. Hey, this isn't even a... There's no bathtub. Oh my goodness. Oh. <laughs> this is insane. Did I miss a inventory thing somewhere? Because it feels like I really just... I gotta put away the trauma pads and stuff. That's probably it. But also, what am I looking for here? Just doesn't seem like there's... 
Yeah, okay. Well, this is room 223. Maybe let me look around the rest of the place first. There's another one here. Okay, I'm gonna go back to the shoebox. Should I put away the flare gun for now then? Because I don't even have a any bullet for it. Oh, inventory management issues. I don't even know if we need the painkillers because I don't... I'm really trying hard to make space here. There just isn't much because that shotgun is gigantic, frankly. And then if we pick up, there's still a flashbang I haven't picked up yet. Yeah, this is... It needs to be draggable with a mouse, not just like clicking and moving, clicking and moving. It feels very console-like. Oh, uh, do I still have the flare gun? No, I took it away. That's, that's fine. Fine for now. Whoa! You're fake, right? I just killed you guys. You know what? Screw this. Oh, they aren't. I just killed them. I didn't think they would come back right away. I didn't look here yet. Oh, there goes my inventory. Getting full and full and full. Night Springs. A special place. A shifting space. Existing in a countless number of parallel realities. Sometimes a quaint small town. Sometimes a hulking metropolis. Different every time we set upon the road that leads us there. And yet... Like a half-remembered echo of a fading dream, always familiar to us. These are the stories that take place there. More inspiring, macabre, terrifying, heartbreaking, nail-biting, absurd, and thrilling. Sometimes all of these things at once. A haunting new season of mind-bending episodes, written by Alan Wake. I am your host. Orlandor. Orlandor. I'll see you soon in Night Springs. That's our first confirmation that his name is Warlin. His first name is Warlin. We should tell Tim about this. So what is this? It's shifting. Okay, so some stuff is breakable. I'm a little bit sometimes like... Because you know, early on I did try shooting two different things and they didn't seem breakable. So it didn't seem like this game had breakable things, but it is, it is breakable. Some of it is. And even just now I tried shooting that briefcase in the other room. Nothing happened, right? What? Ah! Barely saw it. Word of War. Oh, I had a word of A2. What was that from? Mm, effectiveness of trauma pads? Hand flare duration? Effectiveness of trauma pads might be good about here. <laughs> yeah. Words of War. Increases double barreled shotgun damage by 25% when hitting multiple enemies with one shot. Maximum uh, restores health when landing a direct hit with a flare gun. I tend to aim towards the ground on purpose to get more people. I don't even have a flare gun on me right now. I guess I'll do the shotgun. Okay. The Night Springs theme song is what Tim always hums whenever we're in the area too. Hmm. Wait, so the other room might have had a word of power too. Maybe I just didn't see it. Should figure out what it is. 
If you're gonna give me stuff, I want it. But we don't have Tim here, so this place isn't marked. Oh, dude, this is all messed up now. I'm following your arrow. I mean, you can see if it's here or not. On the bathroom wall, we had some trouble because the bathroom wall was white, but this whole room is quite dark colored. Don't really have the same problem here. Anything that needs breaking, though? Okay, we're gonna have to shelve this one for now. I, I I just keep looking at the same places again and again. Wow, that was itchy trigger finger. <laughs> oh. They rewarded my itchy trigger finger. Do you want me to move furniture? You want me to shoot the... It's messed up enough that I feel like I don't know what they want me to look at originally anymore. It was that box. It was like that box right here. Ugh. I'll- I'll ask Tim to help me out later, maybe. Now, there's definitely more people here. More real people. <laughs> Flashbang doesn't even kill them in one hit. 202, reserved for rehearsals. That's right, this is locked. Two oh four. Something is up with two oh five. Yellow tape around two oh six. Dr. Darling? What? Okay. Dr. Darling trying to channel in. that we got before. They don't encourage me to reload until the last bullet is used up. Some indistinct newspaper here. The FBC knows that strange things are happening here, and they've got to control it and make the public safe and all that, right? So they're interfering, which means I should be getting help soon, theoretically. They've been trying to reach through. How long will it take for them to actually be able to help us? That might be a different issue. I don't like this place. It makes me feel very, like, claustrophobic. And we know we have six floors of this place. I don't know if we're exploring all six floors, but there's so many. Tim! I couldn't get in. I was missing something. Damn you. 209. 209. Ballroom. Hey, hold up. We didn't check this side yet. <laughs> is that... Is that the... The board? From control? Okay, it seems like there's actually nothing happening on this side. Or not. Gonna show me some creepy ass mannequins and stuff. It's actually a safe haven here ish. Where's it coming from? Outside? What does that say?
Whatever it says, it's gone. This is... 219. Uh. 202? This is where they gathered before the play. This is where it began. Okay, that's very cool and all. Where the heck? How the hell did we get here from 219? <laughs> Oh, this place is so... Oh yeah, we just went... Ah, it kind of loops over on the other side. Yeah, that makes somewhat of sense. Somewhat of sense. Okay. I'll take it. Alright. 202. So we have the rehearsal room here. Reserve for rehearsals. Great. And then we have the ballroom on this side. Tim, keep humming. Keep me company. Oh dear. The ballroom would be the stage of a key scene in the play. Makes sense. Figure out what happened in the ballroom. <sighs> I... I'm... Okay, I need to take away some of this. Room 101 key. How the hell do we get back to 101? I don't even remember that. <laughs> okay. Alright, it's okay, we're... I'm going insane already, I feel like. Oh, oh, but we have our four scenes. That's a start. Yeah, that's a start. Look around first, look around first. There's actually light in here already. Hmm. It's too quiet, isn't it? Thank you. Word of stuff. Marks all nearby- oh! Marks all nearby sources, resources, and points of interest on Wake's map. Interesting, but Tim does that for me already, doesn't he? Magic Pocket expands Alan's inventory by one row. Battery adds one charge to Alan's flashlight. Oh, I need this right now. Maybe Tim's not gonna always be around or I can bypass him. One charge for the battery might be good too because in the middle of battle, if we have to recharge and all that, that's no good. Who's performing today? Maybe me. The troupe prepared for their performance, calm before the storm. Get the impression they want us to do the rehearsal scene for pre-show first, but we'll try it out. It's not a ballroom anymore. Yeah, they took me off the stage. The cult in the play was called the Cult of the Tree. Ah. With their deer masks, they were the backwoods echo of the cult of the words urban horror. Oh, direct acknowledgement that these are two separate things. Play schedule 2023. Rehearsal in room... It was in 219, now moved to 202. Pre-show ritual... Rehearsal in room 219, now move to 202. Oh, this is on the 22nd, this is on the 24th. 2023? That's after Deerfest then. Deerfest is in September. And then... Premiere. Remember, hit your marks, keep your masks on, and make it weird. Oh, it's weird enough so far. <laughs> mm. Yeah, I think we want to start... The rehearsal in the in the rehearsal scene then. 
Investigate rehearsal room. I'm wondering if we could go back to room 101 first before we do that. And I don't know how to open 209. 101. It's quiet. This one is 225 officially, which used to be 104. If we go back here, I think. By the way, my... I didn't actually check my inventory, actually, after I got the row. I have the row. Good. That's gonna be helpful. Everything else, we'll just have to... Take it as it comes. Posters are... Stop. Wake. Alan, wake. Wake. I was done with that crap. <laughs> Didn't need to be that paranoid, though, it seems like. Room 101. Thomas Zane posters again. Scratch hasn't killed us in 13 years, but we've had trouble for 13 years trying to write, quote-unquote, the right story, too. Which, does that even exist? I don't know. Flare gun ammo. Probably time to bring my flare gun back with the new row. Oh, come on. Thanks. What is that? Batteries. Appreciate it. That's pretty much it. Why is there a pole in the middle of this room? Is it being worked on? Oh, there's multiple. Hmm. Okay. 101 is just for some supplies. Good enough with me. Uh, where do we come from again? 104. This is crazy confusing. Back to my shoebox here. Flare gun. And then... I'll put away the one stack of flare and I'll bring out the two. So this is still not that much space. I think I don't need that many painkillers. I'll have the four stack. I need split stacking, but I don't think it's possible. Good. I don't think I'll be able to use the slot next to my pistol on one, just because I might accidentally activate some other stuff. That's just a spot that I won't. It's my dedicated default weapon slot. Okay, so now that we're back here, we want to investigate the rehearsal room. Which is 219 to 202. We opened it already, so we can go back via 202. Which is right next to me. Right here. We only have one thing we can change it to. Rehearsal room, where it began. The start of the ritual. Oh, the start of the spiral. The actor has played with fire. They open the door for the real cult. Another vision. Another idea. 
No one's here? Okay. Why set up a play in a hotel? Why this hotel? Because the rent is cheap? No. The ocean view was perfect for this. It's said to be haunted. Dark stories about murder, death, suicide. Supposedly, an actual cult once performed an unspeakable ritual to summon something in the ballroom. Did we summon the same thing? Tapped into something horrifying? It, it seemed like it was part of the play, but it wasn't. Does that sound crazy? You don't want to ask me about crazy, kid. A haunted hotel, yes. Mm. That's a trope for a reason. We can make everything haunted now. You want to make the ballroom haunted? I'm going to make the rehearsal room haunted. The play was a ritual waking up a dark sleeper. Oh. It's just scary because I made it scary, okay? Let's try to remember that. I'm going to move this over here. Did you move away the flashbang entirely? Thanks. Do the sticky notes change? No, it doesn't. Like. What? He disappeared. He was real. got to be decisive about things. Clock ain't even ticking. Oh, the last bullet. What was that? There's a thing here. The last bullet does the most damage. Oh, Tim. Wait. Was Tim 205 or was he No, 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 we've been here. I I'm losing track of where what the hell? Yeah, that was a good thing for me because I ran out of flashlight batteries. It was locked from the other side. Oh, Tim is still here. I don't have the key. I didn't kill that guy yet. I didn't kill him yet. Okay, okay. We're back in the ballroom. It is not yet haunted. It will be immediately. A dark ritual in a haunted hotel to summon the star. I recognize my writer's room on the stage. Cute. It's a play. This is a play. You're not actually killing people here, right? But it's the... They're, them putting on the play, I think, is drawing the actual... The power of the actual cult here. Oh, hey. Where's the black dot? I almost dreaded the ideas this would conjure up. Is a black dot on stage? Oh, it is. 
Hey, you even got the nice lighting here. Thanks. What, what was the nice set you got here? What was the scene in this room? Well, this is what we call the writer's room. In the play, it's where the devil rewrites reality whilst God is asleep. The devil was our star role. I got a big time celebrity to play him, and he was method acting the role to perfection. He never broke character, always wore the coat mask. His name was scratched out on the posters. Mm -hmm. And who was this mystery celebrity? Let me guess, Alan Wake? I wish I could tell you, but turns out there were masks upon masks. Whoever he really was, shit got weird when he was around. Some of the crew joked that we'd actually hired the devil to play himself. Haha. <laughs> mm, Mr. Scratch is the devil. He was born to play the role. I had to agree with Casey on that. The devil. Follow the devil's trail. <laughs> We're gonna directly try to find the devil? Alright, if you say so. And the devil did what the devil does. My Kill people. Was affecting reality. This ain't part of the play anymore. There is a paper on the manuscript. Now the nice music plays, huh? Hey, that was... We just gotta be more aggressive about the stuff we use. We have the stuff, we just gotta use it. Who are these people? Still? Okay, we're too... Character in my story. Come on! My story. Can't shoot too fast, as in the accuracy goes way down. I just want to see if there's stuff around here, that's all. I actually put myself right in front of where we need it to be. Yeah, because I, I need this thing. This is not my writing. This is Scratch mocking me. In his room, he will hurt her. Wow. I can't even see that on the page. Oh, it's written in red. It's like red typewriter ink. Oh. All of his trail. I can't even s something here. Whatever. Don't, don't look at it too much. He's just trying to psych us out. The more we pay attention to his words, the more power we're giving him. We're fine. Yes. Flare gun is really nice, and. Big group situations. I'll take out another flare. I think these are all fake because we just fought them. We just go. If they're real, they'll keep following. Damn it, I just used that the one flare I just took out. <laughs> this is new. 216 being open. I don't think these ones were open before. I want to talk to Tim. Show me Tim. Somebody playing beer pong or something in here? Thanks. Yes! 209! That's Tim. That's not good. We're 
on the other side. More dead people. He even had time to smear all the blood on the walls. Hey, man. Hey, Tim. New map, huh? Yep. Look, I've never been to New York, but I can tell you that this ain't it. <laughs> yeah, I don't think so either. I heard you humming again. <laughs> yeah, I... I can't get this song out of my head. It's a real earworm. I heard it in my dreams. I know that song you keep humming. It's the theme from Night Springs. That old sci-fi show? Sci-fi horror anthology. I used to write for a long time ago. Look, it sounds a bit nuts, but I think the song is connected to Door. Or, <laughs> it's my subconscious telling me that this is all pretty out there. We did see a Night Springs intro thing earlier with Door. Thank you. Thank you, thank you. Huh, surprisingly we've- we've- we don't have anything, aside from this one thing. So what was that? They were pointing to something in 223. Were they just telling me, nope, there's nothing there? Because there actually isn't anything there. But there's something by the, the hallway, which I don't think I've ever been at the staircase location before. If you look at the, the brakes, there's no door. There's no way for us to get in. Oh, maybe like via here. We'll check it out in a bit. Where are we right now? What is wrong with this motel? Hotel? <laughs> the layout is so bizarre. Okay. Thanks, man. Love to see you here. Do you just move every time to be near me? Or are there multiples of you? Do you know the answer to that question? Maybe to him, I'm just coming up again and again, somehow. This is a pretty old hotel, huh? Like, this kind of completely discreet bathtub style. I, I've never seen it in real life, actually. It seems like a very olden kind of style. Wow, you've got food in here and stuff. Cool. What have you added? I don't know what's real or uh, what's old and what's new anymore. <laughs> this is old. This is new. The red-headed woman connected to door? I know her. Where do I know her from? Oh, <laughs> from Quantum Break because uh, I think Courtney Hope, who played Jesse Faden, also was in Quantum Break. But not as Jesse, as another character. Her identity changes? Connected to polyhedrons? She will come for me? <laughs> Maybe. I'd really like to play Quantum Break sometime. I didn't play it when it first came out because I, my computer wasn't good enough at the time. But it should be should be pretty okay now. Hmm. Yeah, the red-headed woman was mentioned here. Maybe Tim has seen the TVs when Jesse and Dr. Darling was showing up too. Well, it, it was nice seeing you, Tim. You're a bright light in all this darkness. Thanks for being here. And just... Yeah. Now we gotta follow the devil's trail. We can go to the rehearsal room and make it a devil. We can go to... We can go back to the first floor and make it devilish. So sometimes the neon arrows are just messing with me. Okay, this is where... Oh! Does that not work? Through a glass that doesn't work? How do I go there? But what happened to the one that was breaking down? It was the one that was real! That dude hiding around me? Weird. Anyway, so my problem is I need to go downstairs from somewhere, I guess? Like, through a window, it doesn't count. Or I have to find a place where there's no window. Like here! No, that's a window too. Or a glass, I mean a glass. Okay. 
Well, it looks like we have to go down. Uh, let's go to the rehearsal room then. The rehearsal room is right here. I like flares. Keep giving me flares. Rehearsal room. The actors, the witnesses, and the victims. One and the same, the massacre was real. The plot changed the details of the world. Killed everybody. This was not the ritual murder site I was looking for. This had just been an appetizer before the main course. Yeah, but well, we were in the ballroom already. And changing that part doesn't affect this part. I know, but... Oh, it's gonna bother me. Nothing I can do about it for now. Now, I, I did come from the ballroom. I'm wondering if I missed anything in the ballroom? Okay. We can go back to the first floor. What the hell is... This is getting... Crazier and crazier. Oh, no, 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 no. I'm, I'm going the wrong way. I want to go back to... I want to go back to the first floor, maybe? We did come from here. Change the entrance to a... Devil... Thing. These are the people from the Cult of the Word. Wearing the... Masks and all. Wow, I've been spamming those flares so much, I'm actually starting to run out a bit. A bit. We're good. Oh, wow, you you can't be in my safe room like that. Oh, there's a final scene here as well, aside from the entrance. Maybe that's where the Devil's Trail is. They're here. I'm gonna try the entrance first, because I think that's not right. Shh, shh, shh. Wake. Shh. This is my story. Entrance hall. We can make it haunted, too. The real cult was there. They had taken over the play. The... Freaking making the floor all messy. Chill. Chill, please. No one wake. Okay, they really messed up the place. Damn. Clean up after yourself. This is basic courtesy. 101. Oh, hey. Oh. This <laughs> disappointment after disappointment. Hold up. If we go back up, can we get to the elevator? And then get that word of power from there? Do you think? I feel like it'll go to a different place entirely. Wait, there's an echo there as well? Room 665. Okay, you know what? I'm gonna... Was that just the echo that we saw before? I don't know, man. I I'll have a quick check, since we're here anyway. Anyway, I don't think the place being haunted really changes anything, too. Let's make it the Devil's Trail. Maybe the Devil... went to the staircase because he's a good Devil and realizes that you shouldn't be using elevators during emergencies. They love drawing little swirlies on the floor, though, huh? Okay, so yeah, that's still closed off. It's still closed off. And then... We will... Change it to the devil. The actor of the devil had his own dressing room in the hotel. The devil's path up the staircase was draped in blood. Wake. 
Surprisingly, this is the right one. Then what about the final scene? I kind of want to see that being devil fight too. Okay, some of them seem like they're real now. Isn't that a little bit different behavior than before? Because if they're fake, the light will just dissipate them, but then sometimes you get the ones where they seem like they have a corporeal form, but then they just... Stuff is meant to be used, we should just use it. Oh, definitely a part of me is always like, ah, let's not, let's save it for a little bit more. Okay, I'm gonna try the this scene as well. The devil led the way with a darkness boiling in his skull. Multiple of them are correct? No, this isn't correct. This is just... Please do not disturb. Wanna wait. But this is the first time we've gotten past this. But they probably want me to go... in the stairs first. <laughs> 